So hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm back with another video and on today's video I'm going to be showing you how I did this hairstyle that I have on here. But I wanted to do this hairstyle because I haven't done it in like forever. Because I used to do like this kind of hairstyles on my channel like all the time and you guys love them. So I'm trying to bring this kind of hairstyles again for those of you who have short hair like me and you trying to figure out how to style it. I did like a top knot using like braiding hair and yeah so if you want to see how i achieve this look then keep on watching so this is how my hair is looking i did have like a full-on relaxer like right before christmas i think it was on the 23rd or the 22nd but like on that week of christmas and this is how long my hair is and i haven't like blow it out ever since then that's why the back is a little bit like this and i haven't washed it so this is like the perfect hairstyle right before you go and wash your hair so today we're gonna take it a little bit old school i'm going to do like a top knot so i'm going to create an anchor braid right here So I should have done this step right before I braided my hair but I forgot so I'm going to ap apply some black castor oil and this one is by MPL. I like adding like oils underneath like any gel hairstyles just so that my hair can stay moisturized under the gel because some gels are like tight and when it gets dry it gets like really really tight so i like to have a little bit of moisture underneath so i'm just taking my uh, denman brush and start brushing my hair upwards so i'm not going to be wetting my hair for this hairstyle but if you want to you can Go ahead and do that it doesn't really make a difference it just like when your hair is dry it speeds up the drying process so the gel that i'm going to be using is the perfect touch scalping gel and this is the purple one i get this from clicks so i'm going to start slicking my hair i'm going to start from the back and i'm going to um, apply it coming towards the top where i have the braid And also like this gel is a little bit on the wet side so that's why i don't really like um wetting my hair especially if i have like relaxed hair like this and taking my brush again just brush through to make sure the um the gel is like fully saturated in between the hair so next I'm taking my um, this is like a hard bristle brush and I'm just going to feather sleek everything And on top, I'm going to apply a little bit of this um, got to be glued because this one tends to like just get everything to stick in one place. So I like to apply it on top. I don't like to use it as like the main gel because it's like really, really strong. So I'd like to kind of like seal on top with it. And I'm not applying a lot, just like this much. 
for the whole head which is also like a lot <laughs> and go back with my brush and just brush everything up I'm just taking like a head tie and I'm going to tie this up. And before tying my hair, I'm taking back the got to be glued and a little edge brush and I'm going to um, create some edges here. So I'm just taking my silk scarf and I'm tying everything down and I'm gonna wait for this to dry and then I will come back and we can finish the hairstyle so I'm back now my hair is all dry this is how it's looking so this is the hair that I'm going to be using this is like darling braiding hair this is like the cheap braiding hair I did feather it out here so that I can be able to tuck it around and I'm taking like a little hair tie and I'm going to put it in between here. Um, like so. So I'm going to attach this on my little bun. Like that. So that's secured. So I'm going to start by um, working with one section. And I did brush this out with my Denman brush so that is like nice and smooth but I'm still gonna be applying some hairspray in between this is the perfect touch ultimate hairspray so this is just gonna smooth it out and like cancel the little flyaways in between so I'm gonna start twisting it so I'm gonna twist it going around the little bun first So the more you pull it, it start forming like going upwards, forming like a, a top knot. You always have to like go tuck it under, then it will form like a nice top knot, like everything will be um, balanced up here. And now I'm going to go with the second half of the hair.
and I'm gonna take some bobby pins just to secure it because it's a little bit loose I'm gonna put another one on the other side yeah so that's secured and I'm taking my hairspray again I'm just gonna spray it so yeah this is the final look this is the final hairstyle i love 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 it it's super lightweight like i didn't even use a full pack of hair the technique is all about like building it going upward so this is how it's looking and it's balanced like it's not moving at all so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did don't forget to thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and i'll see you guys in my next one bye